concerned about what you're writing. Yeah. So you're basing so you this on First Amendment you issues? You came over here? So you're basing, basing your basing interest on what I'm writing? Yeah. You yeah. Can concerns see that me. Yeah, it's pretty clearly a First Amendment issue. So I'm glad that we have you on record for that. Concerned about what we're writing. I'm glad that you're making you're that very clear. Because, as I said, I'm, I'm not sure if you're clear what the First Amendment says, but it pretty clearly says that you can't limit people's speech. You can't limit what people you're write. Concerned about it. Uh -huh. Yeah, that's not a legal thing. You being okay. concerned. So, like leave okay, we are not really concerned about what you like. Yeah. yeah, except that we're not tagging. What's your badge number? 5906, sir, put me on YouTube. Okay. Will do. <laughs> I like how as soon as I put my camera down, they show up, you know? Yeah. How <laughs> you fuck, dude? So you guys are refusing to identify yourself. What's your badge number? Both of you, what's your badge number? What's that? Hold it like this. Yeah, yeah hold it sideways. When I asked if we were being detained, he said, of course not. Because we're, not, he, cause we're not actually doing anything illegal. Right. And then the one that refused to identify herself was like, well, let's call patrol. What's your badge numbers? Uh, but she her. didn't. Despite that I've written on the sidewalk, 
claims I'm illiterate. <laughs> right. Well, I mean, it could be limited to what you're writing. So. Yeah, I, I only know. To how be to fair, write when I, write. I mean, right? Uh, you could have studied just certain things. Can I get you guys to email me those pictures too? Here for, uh, our what do we lives? Send me the pictures and email. You can email me yours. Sure. Why do you, why do you feel entitled? Well, mine's it? actually already on the internet. Okay. Well, you're not going to get well, it. I'm not, I don't feel entitled. I'm asking you, will you? No. Okay. So, to be clear, you want us to stop doing this right now? Of course you do. And why is that? Yeah, why is that? spreading messages that will incite others to violence. How do you figure? Read the message. Any mm -hmm. intelligent person can figure that out. So filming the police would incite people. So I'm Excuse inciting me? violence right now. Filming so the police would incite these people. messages will incite mm -hmm. people. I think so. So the cops murdering people on video isn't what's inciting people. Exactly. It's people it writing messages about it. it. Has nothing to do with this. There's a lot to do with it. Yeah. Yeah, because if that wasn't happening, we wouldn't be here in the first place. I'm concerned about why you're here. Well, apparently, you are concerned about why I'm here. No, I'm concerned about what you're writing. So you're basing so you this on First Amendment we issues. You came over here? So you're basing, basing your basing interest on what I'm writing. Yeah, yeah. It concerns me. Yeah, it's pretty clearly a First Amendment issue. No, we, so I'm glad that we have you on record for that. Yeah, I'm concerned about it. What's the First Amendment about? Yeah. What do we have that? What's that have to do with this? It but has this to do with you saying that you're concerned about the stuff we're government? writing. Mm -hmm. Yeah. What is the First Amendment about? You can write it anywhere. Have you read the First Amendment? We're concerned about where you're writing. Oh, so you're you're concerned about the, the place? Of course. The location. <laughs> so then, do we have your permission to go up the street and do it? I'm concerned about right here. That's not very bad. Across from my street. So you're kind of concerned about us writing on public property? I'm concerned about what you're writing. I've already told you that. You're concerned about what we're writing. I'm glad that you're making you're more that very concerned clear. About who's seeing you? Because. As I said, I'm, about the message. I'm not yeah. sure if you're clear what the First Amendment says, but it pretty clearly says that you can't limit people's speech. Okay. You can't limit what people write. I'm concerned about it. Uh -huh. Yeah, that's not a legal thing, you being okay. concerned. Well, mm -hmm. we've politely requested and that we've you go And we've politely to told this. you that we're not going to do that. And I politely asked you guys to leave, actually. Yeah. But you haven't done that. Across my facility. We have a security mm -hmm. interest here. You're inside my city where I live. I'm concerned about that. We're, we're empowered to protect the city. And I'm empowered to live here. I'm also protect empowered by the First Amendment to write stuff. Gibson, right? Whether you like what I'm writing or not. That's how it works. Okay. Well, hmm? Get busy then. Well, I don't know well, that you're not going to attack this. me if I keep Because writing. you obviously are concerned about me. I haven't threatened you. Uh, your presence is threatening me. Yeah. That's an that's a opinion of your own. Yeah. What? That's your opinion. Yeah, no, we haven't threatened I feel you. I'm scared that you're going to attack me if I keep yeah. writing. That's your choice. Huh? And that's your choice to be here harassing us for no reason. All right, you could leave. Yep. Because we pretty clearly have not threatened you in any sort of way. Um, some of these messages are actually threatening. No, they're not. I have, a, I have a question about her camera usage. Um, are you allowed to use cell phone cameras on duty? Me? I'm pretty fine. On your cell phone? Your private cell phone? All right. Yeah. I, I'm not at all worried about you using the cell phone, just for no, the record. No, I'm, I'm not worried about either. I just know that in New York it's not allowed. I'm actually, unlike other people, I'm actually rather happy to have a record of what's going on. Yep. It protects you, too. So. Go ahead. Yeah, you're fine. Thanks, guys. Appreciate yeah, it. it's public property. Which messages are you concerned with? The ones that say uh, justice for Stanley Gibson? Concerned with all the messages, sir. All of uh, them? Uh, yes, sir. <laughs> <laughs> Let's look at these messages. <laughs> yeah. Are you concerned about the one where we would like you to leave? 
It's rather polite, actually. There's actually room. I, I did put a period on there, but I could put please after that. Nah, they said they were special. We are kind of. No. Nope, not at all. You're not afraid to give yours, just yeah, I'm not afraid to give you mine either. I just don't want to. Like yeah, and I'm not armed and, you know, a kidnapper, so. No. You actually have nothing to fear from me. Okay. So, what about you, and what about people who uh, read this and, are and decide to film you? You're worried about people that read this and decide to film you? Yeah. I'm worried about people that shoot unarmed people. Yeah. Yeah. Some are more realistic than others. Nah. Yeah. Some actually happen on a regular basis. Some of those fears. How would you like us to protest there? What would be the proper way, according to you? Free country. Is it though? <laughs> so, In theory, yeah. But then armed people show up when you actually do stuff. Freely. It's free to ride on the sidewalk. Yeah. So and then they sh they call for more armed people to show up. Hmm. Not yet. Yeah. If you're not stopping us, what are you doing? I'm interested in what you're up to. Oh, you're just I see. hanging out. <laughs> what are you doing here? You know what I'm doing here. What are you doing here? You're 
Why are you here? You're interested in this message and putting it on Oh, yeah? Are you I think you actually ought to take an interest in the message. Because people have been warning the cops for a long time that violent people were start to do shit. If cops right kept now, being right? violent, and the cops kept being violent. So I think you guys ought to actually look into that message. About not shooting people. About not arresting people for stuff that actually is a crime. Because most, most jobs have some stipulation that you're not like allowed to just hang out or read on the job. Is there any kind of ETA when these patrol officers are going to show up and threaten us? Is it just open-ended, we're just waiting, or is there some kind of estimate of when they're going to get here? Who's uniform different? Gang members or something? I was going to say casual Friday, but it's actually Tuesday, so. <laughs> I do see why you guys need more cops, though. You know? <laughs> How you doing? There's obviously not enough cops to stand around watching people for no reason. Have you guys seen the Eric Scott video? Yeah, you can't actually park the opposite direction on the street. That's one of their buddies. That's one of their buddies. Yeah. Probably off duty. Yeah. <laughs> See, he likes that one. Yeah. What does that one say? Oh yeah. <laughs> There you go. So, no on the Eric Scott video, or you guys thinking it over, or you guys haven't seen the Eric Scott video? No, or exercising your right not to answer or? I'm just curious it's not like you know obviously you're not required to answer oh, yeah. somebody should talk to that guy about parking on the right side of the street and not in a fire lane how long have you been jail guards Funny. What? Are you laughing? No, I'm just saying, like, 
Yeah. He's kind of describing his emotions. She's really aggressive, and if we're allowed to film, she shouldn't be telling me to stop filming. I don't want to be here right now. I just want to make sure that you guys don't come after us later. Because you're all upset right now. You're free to go. No, I know I'm free to go. I want you to tell us that it's okay to chalk. On like your guys' uniform colors, is there like a policy of difference because yours is a little greener or is it just like his is older so it faded? Is he in a different unit? What, what's up with it? You guys still use those giant jailhouse keys? Those are really cool. Like you guys still should use those, even if you don't have to. I mean, you gotta admit you like those keys. I'm like the big ones, they're like a foot long. So all three of you are just standing here for no reason other than you're interested, right? Well, I thought we were waiting for the patrol officers. Are they not what, coming? What are you doing here? So are the patrol not coming? Because that's what I'm waiting for. I'm going to call CCDC. And tell them that their officers are spying on them. All right. You know what? I don't believe we got his name and badge number. Or the guy who appears to be a member of the gang unit. Can we get their name and badge numbers? Is that a no? Because you guys are actually legally required to tell us. You don't know what his name is? Is that what you said? Uh, well, he could probably tell me. <laughs> yeah, they're just visiting though. <laughs> Is there a basketball court up there? Because I thought I heard people playing basketball one time when we were here. Do you know? Is there a basketball court up there? What's your badge number? Yeah. A222. Okay. A222. So, what was your name and badge number? 7609. 7609? Okay. And to be clear, there's not a basketball court up there? Okay. So, you don't actually work for the jail? Yeah, I'm not sure who this guy is. He must be undercover. I'm going to try chalking again, even though I'm terrified. Yeah. I would like to get an answer on whether the patrol people are coming or not, because if they're not, I'd like to go chalk again. It's gonna do it since they told us we could. Well, yeah, they're just but interested. right. Well, that's the thing. I'm waiting for the patrol to show up, but if they're not going to show up anyway, then I'd like to go ahead and chalk. We were just hanging out. So, are we waiting for patrol officers to show up, or are they not coming? Yeah, I don't know what you're waiting on. Actually. Okay. Well, I was waiting on that answer, but... Yeah. The, the Stanley Gibson was sitting in a car completely unarmed and knowing nothing to nobody was pretty horrible. <laughs> 